Notice, the Kalmar system is now subject to a Class 1C Emergency Wormhole Bond Transit Order until further notice. Violators will face the maximum punishment permitted under the provisions of the Emergency War Powers Authorization Act. Notice, the Kalmar system is now subject to a Class 1C Emergency Wormhole Bond Transit Order. Authorization validated. By gubernatorial order, proceed to the Planetary Governor's Office on the Copenhagen Kalmar. My current orders are time sensitive. By gubernatorial order, proceed to the Planetary Governor's Office on the Copenhagen Kalmar for a briefing before continuing. Copy. Ah, uh, Commander Taylor. I am Jens Anderson, governor of and a humble servant to the people of Kalmar. It is a pleasure to meet you. The pleasure is mine, Your Excellency. Sit down. Sit down. Can I interest you in some coffee? No, thank you. Are you sure? The Kalmar bean is of exceptional quality and grown right here on planet. I'm sure. I see. May I ask, Commander, where you're from? I'm from Providence. Ah, an upworlder. They are humbled by your presence. We don't get many upworlders here nowadays. Or we'll do that. I am on my way to resolve some matters and rolling in and by the authority of the Naval Special Forces and requesting permission for wormhole access. Of course you have permission, but before you go, I would like to ask you something. Now I am sure you are aware of the destruction that has befallen Kalmar. Why, during the last Clickstick raid, they destroyed several of our munition factories and also much of our terraforming equipment. You and I both know how important our production capabilities are to the war effort, so I don't understand why our military strategists have not positioned us further away from the front lines. I've been messaging for weeks requesting a wormhole reconfiguration so that we no longer are a primary target and have yet to receive an answer. I know you are but a commander, but surely as a member of the Navy Special Forces, you might have some influence? Sir, the wormholes are configured as they are for a reason. We must build layers between Sol and the border worlds, you know that. I understand, but why can't we move Unity to the front lines? Why not Slavia? Why must it be my people who suffer? Would you rather the hundreds of millions in Unity die instead? Kalmar barely classifies as a developed system. Your Excellency, your world is rather expendable. I see. Well, if my world is so expendable, perhaps I should just surrender to the clickstick now, shouldn't I? Less forgiving man in my position might misinterpret that statement. I think we both know what would happen then. I beg forgiveness, Commander. It's just I've been a little less than happy with the Navy as of late. You see, you see, the reason we've had to lock down our borders is because of a rogue naval commander. He's taken crucial wormhole details. That's part of why we need the wormhole reconfiguration and while we've had to close the borders until we've trapped him. I see. Do you know anything about this rogue naval commander? Perhaps I could assist. Commander Taylor, the people of Kalmar thank you, but we have this handled. We have laid for this defector a trap, a, a snare so perfect there's no chance he can escape. Why, in fact, it is our fear that if the Navy Special Forces got it, uh, involved, then it might reveal our plan to them. We, we fear that they are still connected to the Navy Communications Network. Very well.
you are free to go. Understood. The last Flickstick attack left us severely weakened. We've had to fly in new supplies. You upworlders don't see that, but this is what it's like for us downworlders every day. Your planet looks repaired to me. Well, our terraformer has been shot, and then other provinces around have had similar other repairs they've... Thank you for your time. Commander. Computer, open the work transit control database. Choose all approved requests to enter Rex at Kelmar facing repulse of future transit date times. Describe the top few entries. No results found. Not even in the distant future. Correct. Approval says temporally distant as March 2354. Existed, but were rescinded. Monitor all Kalmar wormholes for unauthorized usage, then Holocall Governor Anderson. Something solved. Placing Holocall. Commander Taylor, I don't think you understand how busy I find myself in these trying times. My schedule does not permit such- Your Excellency, why has Kalmar closed its wormholes to ships arriving next year? Is that necessary for catching your- Supposed deserter. Ah, uh, I think I understand now, Commander. Unfortunately, I have been forced to cancel all approvals until the defector has been caught. Standard practice permissions of this type. Rather, I'm surprised that you took it upon yourself to search the Calmar section of the War Transit Control database without any prior approval. And further, that you are now telling me how to run no, my no time for approval. There is a war going on. I must do whatever is necessary to ensure that humanity remains secure. Of course. You are right. I was elected before the war, and I'm still coming to grips with this new chain of command. The people of Kalmar would be happy for you to help in the investigation in any way possible. If you would simply return to the offices, I would be pleased to personally brief you on the subject. No. That will not be possible. Be aware, Commander, that you are meddling with matters which are beyond your remit. I have given you several chances to disengage yourself, and you still refuse. Mm. Things are moving faster than anticipated, but everything's ready. Prepare the ships. Set up the broadcast. It's time to end this war. I can watch. Computer. Prepare ship weapon systems and move toward the planetary defenses. I want to understand what game is playing. Fellow citizens of Kalmar, I recognize that I am requesting your attention on quite short notice, but I am hoping that you will celebrate with me, for the darkness of the night will soon be forgotten. Today will be remembered as a bright new dawn for the people of Kalmar. None of us need be reminded of just how dark the night has been. When the Plague State incursion reached us, the lasers fell upon the world like lightning. The skies were darkened, the rivers turned to blood. Millions of souls were lost, and even more rent by grief. You remember that day vividly because you were there. You saw what the Plague State did to our beloved home in that time of tribulation. Yet, if the Clickstick have crushed the oceans and mountains beneath their heels, our human brothers have done the same to our spirits and souls. The anthem of the united human worlds heralds liberty, equality, and fraternity. Yet, where is liberty when war measures have been used to erode our constitutionally guaranteed rights into non-existence? 
Where is equality and fraternity when the long-established worlds of Parliament have rearranged the wormhole connections to protect themselves, leaving us to be slaughtered? Be aware, my friends, that there is no salvation for the mass of humanity, but for the people of Kalmar, there is hope. Why are our sons and daughters getting slaughtered on the world slayers away from us? Why do we bear the brunt while soul escapes unharmed? No more. Kalmar will no longer be shadowed to her. Computer, report Anderson. Will no longer be shadowed to her. Link me back in. Link me back in. Today is the day Kalmar leaves the Union of Worlds. Today is the day Kalmar is free. I will lead Kalmar into a bright new era. Free from the war that has plagued us. Free from upworld meddling. We will build a new society. Kalmar Republic. We've already liberated Kalmar from the occupation of the military, but for us to be truly free from the united human worlds, we must destroy what binds us to the other planets. Behold. Let humans and clickstick fight to the death. Kalmar will be free. Yeah, show for my four. Kalmar, I'll find one more. Let's go. Come around three, hold me, hold one more. Uh, 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 u